impact of the ongoing armed conflict in Sudan. A group of volunteers have initiated measures to renovate damaged hospital beds and other items. According to the WHO, about 11 million people needed medical support in the country and the volunteers are working to provide the much needed assistance uh, for them. Now, many of Sudan's import or important sectors, including the health system, have been paralyzed or damaged. Now, let's have more details of that in this report. Amidst the backdrop of civil war, a group of volunteers in Port Sudan are fixing damaged hospital beds and other items to help local medical institutions cope with the severe supply shortage. The Green Initiative is a free program to repair and refurbish medical equipment for hospitals in Central and Eastern Sudan. We are glad to provide some assistance to hospitals and patients. Many patients don't have hospital beds, so what we can do is to fix beds, stretchers and benches for them. Our effort has now reached many places. With some 11 million people needing medical aid, according to the World Health Organization, the Green Initiative is poised to bring much needed support to the country's crippled medical system. Over the past few days, volunteers have helped us repair many hospital beds with one, two and three cranks, as well as stretchers. They have also designed and built carts for transporting medical waste, effectively reducing the risk of virus spread and infection. According to UN estimates, intense fighting that broke out last April between the Sudanese armed forces and the paramilitary rapid support forces has killed over 15,000 people and displaced more than 8.8 .8 million others.